We're joined now from New York by lawyer Jacqueline Newman. Uh, now, look, you've appeared before the same judge uh, as this one in the Madonna case. Mm. I suppose but back here in the UK, we're thinking, why is this all so public? Why is the I, fate of 15-year-old boy feel, so public? I feel... So, really, Jacqueline, I feel very uncomfortable discussing it. It feels like a private family matter. You know, he's, a, he's, he's under 16, he's not a, an adult. How, how is it that all these details mm. are so, as, as Pierce says, it's, it, you know, everybody knows about it? Yeah, well, in New York, I mean, matrimonial files are sealed. However, you know, I think it's naive to think that when you have people that are in such the public eye that there aren't going to be people that are going to be leaking on some level, that, you know, you can make phone calls, clerks are speaking on some level. I mean, it is private and they shouldn't be, they shouldn't be talking about it, so I absolutely agree with you. I mean, one of the issues here, I guess, in response to that is it should be private, but Madonna has been on the social media airwaves now on an almost daily basis, Instagramming her son, mm -hmm. telling the world I'm desperate for him to come back, whilst also behaving, as you know, many people think, in a particularly un undignified manner on stage throughout all this. You put it all together... And if you're that boy, you might be thinking, I don't want anything to do with this. Well, why is, why is my mum doing case, all this? Jacqueline? I think that that is what's going on. I think this is a child that is being exposed to things he doesn't want to. He wants mm. stability. He wants to be in a situation where he has a normal family life, and he's not getting that, obviously, on tour with his mother. And when his mother is in the public eye and making him part of the public eye when he wants his privacy, it's just showing that she's not respecting him. As Pierce says, mm. you've appeared, you know, you know you, this judge. Uh, what is the judge like, and, and are we able to sort of predict the outcome? Uh, she's an excellent judge, I will say that, and she will absolutely consider, you know, what Rocco has to say about it. She cares very much for children. So to predict what's going to happen, you know, that's obviously a little hard. We don't know what evidence they're going to be producing. But I think that this judge is going to take his positions very seriously, and I wouldn't be surprised if, you know, she ultimately rules that he can stay with his father in London.